the team spirit, Lizard? <sighs> it's so hard. But yeah, sure. Why not? Now let's go with All the right. Breaker. You know, like that was close. Just Doom's owning mid. Like he's doing really well, especially with the regen war. White Mon. Charge over on a White Mon. First dive right on top of him as well. Taking a lot he of damage here. 23, trying to maybe get a kill before that first blood comes out. But Mira will get credit for that first blood. Something else I was going to mention earlier. I think uh, our B-Cop uh, is, is having some problems. He just got me for a second. Uh, lucky you. I, I can still... Yeah. I, I've, oh, I've here, come back. Here. My here. Dota just crashed. I still have the ob speed though. Oh, White Mon getting a little oh, bit low. Rolling Thunder coming through. Collapse gets the kill on a White Mon. Yeah, I was going to say before, something that uh, is worth mentioning this game. Oh, Cookie. Oh, almost dodged by Mira. Oh. Scatter Blast. Mira, he's going to fall. Charge comes in onto the Doom. Carl, though. It could have been okay, but... Limps on a Zephyr, charge coming in. Got the Sunray, they have the Rolling Thunder. Fire Snap Cookie, ooh, avoiding the Rolling Thunder, but that's not going to keep him alive. And that'll be the 10th kill there for Team Spirit. Again, all this while Yaturo is farming. But 23 Savage comes in, should have a kill here on Mavoshka, especially with the help coming through from Cuckoo with that Burrow Strike. That Blink Dagger to cover the ground. Now the Phoenix, 23 right under his nose. Carl denies the tower. There's the blink as well as the Burrow Strike as the Icarus dive is going off. They get the kill on Amira. Now Yatoro is trying to turn this. Maybe get a kill there on a Cuckoo, but they've got the purification to keep him. And now Team Spirit, they're trying to make a play. They're trying to find something, but uh, yeah, White Mon will show himself. They've got the charge coming in, and there's the barrage coming out from 23. They're going to go into the Metamorphosis, but the Burrow Strike hits from Cuckoo. Looking for the Epicenter to follow it up. They've got Good the Doom coming up for the Terror Blade. They should have the damage to get this kill. They'll take out White Mon, but in return, it's a Terror Blade of Yataro. Toronto, Tokyo, Swashbuckle doesn't get down to the low ground either with a Shield Crash. Oh, dear. That's two big kills there for T1, and they're looking for more. They smell blood in the water, and they really want to take advantage, and they will. Static Storm as well as the Sunray on Zephyr. He's getting charged, but a two-man stun. Zephyr might die, but he's happy to do so if they can no get the life way. of two. And now they've got the purification. He won't even die. So what Zephyr stands his green. Uh, Step Carl, is he even going to die? Charge comes in. They've got a TP coming through, but the Blink Burrow Strike, they were looking for the ult, and that's going to save Carl. And now the ult once again, and he yules. So Cuckoo, he ends up dead. Uh, Savage. And 23 in some trouble. Rolling Thunder. Uh-oh. Uh 23 may have bitten off more than he could chew, but they've got the purification, and White Mon TP's in to give the Sunder over. Uh, T1? I mean, the was behind. He's got Scotty Manta as well as the Lincolns with 1,700 gold saved up, technically ahead of this Clinks by a little bit with the BKB being popped. They've got themselves the Doom out under the Terror Blade. They're going to Sun Ray to try and keep him alive. And now the Glimpse. And I'll try to help TV maybe be able to run away with the BKB running Ooh. out. Sun Ray trying to keep him alive, and they get the kill on Yotaro. Now the look over is the Rolling Thunder is bouncing Carl up into the air. They've got the Swashbuckle. The purification comes in from White Mon to save him. Epicenter right there. Burl Strike the Shield lands. Crush. Next shield is there. Shield Crash. Ooh. Toronto, Tokyo. Ooh. Jukin jiving, but eventually the gold away from the Ags on the Disruptor. He's been trying to get that. Oh, they found the Clinks for a second, but they're going to get the Blink in the pop of Link. So get the Doom out onto the oh, Terrible. Now the Mortimer's Kisses is coming through. They'll take out Yatoro at 70 seconds without this TB. They get the Static Storm as well as the Kinetic Field. They've got the Purification. They're going to keep alive this Doom. The Silence is no longer on them as the Static Storm runs out. The Storm is past. The Eye of the Storm is over I them, and they'll get the kill in a collapse. Lincoln's for both 23 and Cooper. They're going to go for this here. They're going to at least try. Very tough. Toronto, Tokyo with the Rolling Thunder. Not really getting touched. And Carl, he picked up that refresher. So he's got Doom available again. But the Burrow Strike comes in. They get the kill in the Toronto, Tokyo. They'll get Pango gone for 80 seconds. Collapse trying to make something happen with the right clicks coming out on Amira. They get the kill in the Phoenix. He'll buy back immediately with the BKBs being popped by 23. In 10 seconds. There's the Glimpse as well as the Static Storm that mutes up Carl. But he's so tanky. There's no extra damage to follow this <laughs> up. <laughs> I don't know what difference any army builds made, makes, but...
So they're going to try and defend, but they've got the blink as well as the Burrow Strike coming in on Amira. And Toronto took you over to the side. There's the first Doom. And again, he does have that refresher, but Disruptor lays down the Static Storm with this Axe. It's not going to do anything. They get the kill here as well as Toronto Tokyo. They're going to buy back on the pick over here. They look over at Yotaro, but the Burrow Strike comes in. They get the kill of the Terror Blade. It doesn't have buyback. Rolling Thunder in. Not even going to matter. The second Doom is put onto the Pangolier, and they will call GG on Team Spirit. T1 will take game one with pretty much complete ease. Yeah, I mean, there was that one scary moment in the game for T1, right? Right. Where they uh, fed the net worth lead a little bit back in the uh, in the bot lane. Performance for, from him, because it is a very decent Void Spirit game. There. Well, let's go with the Spirit right. Breaker. You know, whenever... Like some pretty stellar Chain Frost with, like, the Ice level Fire. One. Yeah, he's on the run, and one shot from dead here. Right now, surviving, but Maposhka comes over. Body blocks him. Fairy Fire surviving a little bit longer. More right clicks come in. Storm Hammer on to Zephyr. Not one, but potentially oh, two is... here. And the shield crash, but Maposhka surging. Ooh, actually gets this. 13 one charges now as well, so. Oh, I couldn't quite block him in the trees, unfortunately, but... That's the one yeah, charge. Sap, Venomous Gale once again, and now Zephyr getting low. He needs to turn around and run. They've got another Brain Sap available. They'll use it. Nightmare up Cuckoo, and that'll lead to Toronto Tokyo coming over, and Cuckoo will get a kill before he dies, which is all right, but... Sven. He has no doppelganger here on the PL. And they're going to run and try and chase 23. They've got the Void. They'll jump on top of him with the... Fissure 23, Spearlands, and well, the Sinister Gaze! But the Void uh, is there, they'll get the kill, now. Collapse will get 23, and they're gonna go after Whitemon. Ooh. He's is dead. he in range? Yeah, there it is. So double kill for Collapse, and that lane seems like are pretty much even or better. <laughs> Whitemon. Uh, Zephyr wakes him up and he's like, oh no, please. Oh, oh wow. no, oh no. And now they're both dead, I think. <laughs> yep. Brain sap comes that they need. Like that, again. Ooh, Poshka. Poshka. Uh, they're going to have Nightmare. They're going to have Boots of Travel coming in. That means they'll have the control with the Here Fiend's Grip. But also, 23 is going to show himself. So Maposhka is going to hold his ground, go to the Fiend's Grip, try and lock down Carl enough to get the kill, and they will do exactly that. Now Toronto, Tokyo, not dealing with a lot of mana on the other side of this fight, though. They've got themselves a spin who goes after Cuckoo. They've got the Fissure to follow it up. It goes into the Essence Ring as well as the Four Staff. Venomous Scale, BKB, Yotaru gets the kill on a Cuckoo. So that's two dead on the side of T1. A very good fight right now oh from the side God. of Team Spirit with Collapse going in and killing off Zephyr. So it's no, yeah. so he's not going to be as strong. If they can get him, Four Staff coming through, and now they're going to get the Rolling Thunder. They've got themselves the Chain Frost bouncing around over to the Ancient. They get the first life out of the hands Maybe of the Spain. Fissure now hits onto Zephyr, blinding light pushing over this Earthshaker. Oh. But if I were, I would just say, because I said so. Oh, that's right. So, 3k oh, yeah. now they're going to blink in, and they'll go after the Phantom Lancer, and he's oh, immediately no. just dead. They get the kill on a 23. They're going to throw the Chain Frost over, and that's not going to lead to anything. And again, we talked about it. We talked about T1 not back available. Astro Step once again, dropping down the Aether Remnant. That's not going to land. Goes to the Dissimulate. Which he does have those oh, the extra spots with the shard, and now they're gonna go through. Oh They've got themselves God, the Sinister the Gaze for the damage going into 23. He just used all his gold to buy out on a butterfly. They get the kill on a cuckoo to follow that up with the BKB as well as the God Strength going towards the end here on Yoka, right? And so they have permanent nighttime basically because of the uh, whenever he pops out, if he blinks first, you get the cooldown reduction, right? So we're fine with BKB being popped, and now they're going to go after this Coddle. They'll get the kill on a Carl. He is very dead, especially with that BKB and the jump forward from Toronto, Tokyo. And they're going to use that God Strength with the BKB. Oh, take dear. out Cuckoo, take out 23 Savage, rip through both of them. And they will call GG. We'll be going to another Game 3. Team Spirit start to finish, have control of this one. Really well played by Spirit. They felt like, yeah, they were just... They were always had their, like, two hands, like on the game, right? They, they never like let one hand go and they kind of like half-hearted it a little bit. It felt like they were always in the right place. Well, that's gonna just about round off these drafts or something, <laughs> these drafts anyways. Um, anyone brave enough to vote for the sniper then, I guess? Fun, Fun for who? The sniper? Oh, the, the sniper, yeah. I will say that they have the bulwark on the Mars. 
um, against the sniper, which in late game could be really strong. Oh, the arrow hits! Oh boy. Zephyr in a lot of trouble, and he is going to be first. Oh, he was like 7 and 5 just a second ago, now 17 yeah. and 5. Here comes Holy the Titan, Titan Spirit. Magic missile thrown over on a Maposhka wave of terror as is well. They've got themselves the brain sap, and Zephyr going to get run down here. It'll be Maposhka who gets the kill. Oh dear. Not good. Not good. Uh... The smoke towards top. Oh my Magic god. Magic missile, great dodge with the illusion room, but they've got the swap into the nature's grass. They'll use the arena. And with the right clicks coming through, Cuckoo's getting low, but they've also got the help coming through from Carl. And now, unfortunately, He's hit by that Fiend's yeah, Grip. Maposhka just standing his ground. They've got themselves the call down. The look over the Nightmare is going to land on a Carl. They get the kill to wipe on. That's going to be two dead. Double damage on Yotaro. And they'll find a third. Carl falls. And Team Spirit come out ahead on that fight. I say that. Ooh. Wow, Tokyo goes down to Zephyr, who will be traded. And Mira a bit far and potentially a bit dead. But another save there from Maposhka. Wave of Terror, they had the Sentry down, trying to get the swap. They're going to swap uh, Tron on Tokyo into the Nature's Grasp. He's in a little bit too far, and he's going to be dead. Oh, boy. Uh, they kill the Clinks, and 23 from going into a bad position into an advantageous one to kill the Clinks is exactly where he wants to be. Oh, Maposhka, stop. He may not survive this, but... Ooh, back to the other side is Yotaro as well as Collapse, and that's going to take the attention off of Maposhka. They're going to turn this around on 23. They've got the spear. They'll get the kill. They'll take out 23. They look over at Zephyr, trying to TP out, and Elder Titan falls too. Make it a third. White Mon, see you later. And it's a fourth as Cuckoo hits the deck over to the side. Triple kill for Yotaro, and it's a 6k lead again at the cost of... Jaro's dead. It's not looking likely, but... Tower Aether Remnant locking collapse. down Collapse. Nightmare again, the gods rebuke, but the assassinate coming through. They've got the swap once more, so Collapse, he's trying to run, but the astral step is there, and they'll get the kill. Carl will get credit for that one. He was hit by the spear. They'll try to get oh, Toronto Tokyo a kill as they finish off Cuckoo, but again, Cuckoo's got the axe, so everything's available. They the sniper. They've got the swap into the nature's grass. They'll look over at Toronto Tokyo to try and get the kill into the clinks. They'll find him. Carl, it's gone. So is White Mon. Oh boy, 23 on the run, Yule's up into the air, Mira trying to get it done with the Star Storm, but it's not going to be enough damage, they get the kill there, and now they're going to look over as the call now comes out, but Yatro, he'll kill off two, and finish off the... Let's see... Oh, the Sniper! Ooh, 23's at the front, the Arena on the back, uh... he's going to concussive grenade away, and now this Arena doesn't exactly feel worth it, they might be able to get the kill on a White Mom, but that's going to be it so far, Cuckoo now, Magic Missile onto this Gyro, Assassinate thrown forward again. Cuckoo's got that second life to play with. They'll pop the BKB on Yantaro. The question is, do they want to sw swap him back in? They'll finish off Mira. It ends up being a two for one. All right, Fiend's Grip coming through onto Zephyr. And they'll finish a third. Ooh, Aether Remnant doesn't land. Dissimilate. Trying to catch up. Maposhka. It'll at least be a trade. Yeah, let's forget back. They'll TP in. He goes to the Shadow Blade. They're going to look for the Blink as well as the Spear. They look over at 23, but they've got the swap coming out from Cuckoo. And now they hit the stun onto the Gyrocopter. Right click damage coming with the BKB pop by 23. They'll get the kill to Cuckoo. And now they're going to look over as the cooldown comes out. 23 taking a lot of damage here. Ooh boy. Needs to start running. That BKB's only going to last so long. And there's the Yules. 23. He's got an Aegis to work with. Can the again. rest of his team save him? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, they've got the Spear. They have the Rocket Barrage. They'll get themselves a second. Elder Titan does have that shard as well as the Ags now, and they're on the low ground. Blink looking for the spear, but immediately the swap as well as the Magic Pistol. They look to get the kill to collapse. They've got the arena, but it's not going to land on a 23. He's on the other side of this. They get the Kona Cuckoo. They're going to have them that illusion. The sweep hits onto the Gyrocopter as well as the Mirana. Nice, so they're going to kind of collapse. They're taking the Mars. And now they're going to look over the rest with the Earth Splitter landing on a Toronto Tokyo as well as Maposhka. There's the Nightmare trying to run and assassinate no over onto the Mirana. But they've got the Yules up into the air. And now they get the Kona Maposhka. They'll finally take out the main. It's going to be a two for one. Oh. Entry down. They've got the swap now. They're going to go in and we'll try and get the silence of the VKBB pop by Toronto Tokyo. Meteor Hammer coming through. They've got the damage to get the kill on Zephyr as well as Cuckoo. Zephyr's going to buy back. They took the Aegis out of the hands of the Sniper. They're right on top of him, but do they have the damage to finish him off a second time? Mars is here, and now they'll go for 23, but the overgrowth right. comes in. That's going to land on the two. Mira throwing an arrow. That's going to land on a Carl for a split second. They're going to kill the collapse. They'll take the Mars for 79 seconds. Who does that buyback? Maposhka falls. He's dead for 69. He's got buyback as well. 23 dealing with about half his health. Cuckoo gone once again. 
again, tip for 108 seconds, set for right up on him, and Yandro's gonna die to Carl. You've got four heroes dead on the side of Team Spirit with a buyback coming up from Collapse. Do they commit the complete buyback, or do they wait for T1 to try and... Yeah, they're gonna go. go, they're gonna try and make the move. They've got the spear that's gonna throw 23 onto the high ground, but he's got the concussive grenade, and he just got pushed so far oh, back. back. The is gonna be used. They've got the white bond treant dead, and he's already so far away. It was Cuckoo getting the swap that saved the sniper, but they get to go to Cuckoo. He's gonna be alive oh, again. He's got an illusion. Yataro ends up dead. He's gone for two minutes. They've also taken out this Bane. They're gonna look over and try and get the kill on the Toronto Tokyo. The Ear Splitter comes in and now Collapse is trying to defend himself. But the right quick damage coming through with the help from Zephyr as well as Carl. They should be able to get the kill onto the Mars and will. He's got buyback 3v4, but really a 3v4. They're gonna try and use this Invis to get behind this sniper and use that spear. That's exactly what they're gonna get off. They've got the Glade here, but there's the swap once again coming out from Cuckoo. Cuckoo keeping his sniper away. There's the concussive grenade. Once again, they get the kill to Maposhka as well as collapse. But they get the kill to Zephyr Yatro trying to do with the flat cannon. Oh but the BKB by 23. Toronto Tokyo outputting the damage. Yatro is going to go in on this one. And now they've got the kill and they'll take out the sniper. It's only the first life though. They need to commit on to the second. They've got White Mon nearby. He doesn't have overgrowth, but he does have the force staff. And that's going to push his sniper on the high ground. They get the kill on Amir. They look over. Yatro is going to pop the BKB. Go over on a White Mon. And they got the stun finally hitting on the sniper. They look over. 23 getting run down on the Rocket Barrage is also damage coming up from Yatro as well as Toronto Tokyo. They'll finish off 23. He's got buyback. I think they've already known that. But they have got the to refresher. go. Now they're going to look over 23. They've got the Glade Nair onto this sniper. Oh, the damage, but they've got the swap and now into the leap. He leaped in the Aether Remnant. They'll get the kill here onto the Courier of Collapse and they'll take out Mir, but they end up losing 23 and they've got buyback available on the sniper and they're going to use it. Cuckoo, he's low. He's gone. The illusion survives. Oh. And that's going to be the second life here for Cuckoo, but they get the kill here on Yatro as well as Zephyr. And Yatro, he's dead for two minutes, and Mira's dead for two as well. They get the buyback coming up from the sniper as well as this Elder Titan. Let's see if they can finish. Yule's up into the air. I believe that was the Wind Waker up into the air. They've got the Dissimulate. They'll look for the Spear, but it's not going to land. Dodge. Carl will get the kill on him. Aposhka. Now they're looking over as Toronto Tokyo is going to be taunted up and killed off. Four years dead without buyback. They'll call GG, and T1 will take the series 2-1. Did you see Zephyr like three shot the gyrocopter or something stupid at the end? I don't know how many shots it was. It's like three or four it looked like. But he was looking for the rampage, man. <laughs> Zephyr doing I such I told you. Huge damage. I mean the reason they win that last fight is because they have the buyback.